In this video tutorial, I want to show you how to add items into the Your Stuff section of My Big Campus. Now, this would include any sort of file, which would be a picture or an audio recording or a word processing document or PowerPoint or Keynote presentation. Any sort of file you would have saved on your computer can be added in. You can also add in websites and YouTube videos. Now, I want to point out first before we go into Your Stuff that you see this blue line of links a lot of different places in my big campus. It's right here on the wall, it's in all the group areas, it's in schoolwork areas. So anytime you see this line, if you go to new file or new photo, if you go to something here and add it this way, it's going to automatically put it in your stuff. Okay, So if you're wanting to post something and you add a file, it's going to be there right away. But sometimes you might want to add stuff into this section so that you can use it and attach it easily later. So we're going to go into the Your Stuff section. Same thing is true if you go to the library up here and add YouTube videos or websites through the library. They will also appear in Your Stuff. So right here we have an Add button and it gives us three options. We have the files that I mentioned earlier, YouTube videos, or websites. So let's start with the file. I can click here to upload files and I can you know, choose any file I want to upload and find something that's not out here. Let's say I want to use this one. Click upload and I gotta wait for this picture to finish loading. And when it does, it's gonna show up in my list here. So there it is. Over here, I can click on this to add it to my photos page. That would put it as part of my profile or I can click Add to the My Big Campus Library. And that's going to share it so that other people can search for and find that picture and use that graphic as well. Now let's say I want to add a YouTube video. First of all, I'm going to click on Add YouTube and I get this page. But I need to go to the YouTube video that I want to upload. So I found this video on YouTube. I want to use it in my classroom. I don't want it to get blocked. I don't want students to see anything that might pop up over here because you never know what that's going to be. So I'm going to go here and I can grab the URL from up here or I can click share and get it from right here. I'm going to right click to copy it and then I'm going to go here and right click again and paste it in the YouTube video address line. I'm going to press the get info button. Okay, now this one right here says this item already exists, which means somebody else has already put this YouTube video into the My Big Campus library, which is the point that you might want to go search the My Big Campus library before you try to add a video, but you can always just do this and it'll tell you if it's already there, and then it's telling me that it's been added to your stuff. So now this particular video will be listed in my Your Stuff link. Now, if I don't get this response, um, it may fill in these boxes for me, and I can click Add, and now this video will be part of the My Big Campus Library and will also show up in my Your Stuff section. Third option that may happen is that it may tell you that it can't find information on this video, and then you will have to fill in each of these things and click Add, and then that YouTube video will be present. Back in Your Stuff, we're going to do our last option. We're going to click Add Website. Let's say that I wanted to add a particular, this website into my big campus. Again, I'm going to grab the URL. I'm going to copy it. This is just like the YouTube video page, except it's a website now. So I'm going to paste that. I'm going to click Get Info. And see, it's filled in the title, but it hasn't filled in the rest. So I would have to fill in each of these boxes, give it a category, give it a minimum and maximum grade, and then click Add. And from that point on, this website would be in the Your Stuff section, so I could easily add it um, any place I had that blue line. It would also show up in the My Big Campus library. So then that item would be here in Your Stuff. Everything that I've added is going to be listed, and I can search it as well. If it's already in the My Big Campus Library, you can search it from here and not have to go through all that process. 